Ooh, what are you making? Oh, well, this is a yummy, yummy fall treat. I can't wait to show you guys what I'm making. Right here that I'm putting on is gonna be some pre-melted butterscotch. You don't wanna miss out on it, so you wanna get all that drops right into the pan and get it. a spatula is gonna be your best friend here, but just so you guys see, I'm using the Toll House butterscotch chips. So now that we've gotten that, I'm gonna come in with some dry roasted peanuts and you're gonna just sprinkle them on here. I'm gonna use a little bit over a cup, but feel free to put as much or as little as you want. I just think that's a good amount. So now that we've got that, you're just gonna give everything a real good mix. Really get all those pieces coated as much as you can. That looks like it's gonna be great. It sure is. I cannot wait. I wish you guys could smell what we smell. It is smelling delicious. All right, so we've got this all nice and mixed together as you can see. And so what we're gonna do is just pop this right on over and I'm gonna bring in a pan here. You can use any pan you wish, but I went with a circular pan that I have and you're just gonna grab little scoops from your pan here and clump them together. You don't have to be pretty. It doesn't have to be perfect by any means. And you're just gonna repeat this process until your pan is completely emptied. So I'm just gonna go ahead and keep this going. All right, guys, so now that we've gotten our layer that we're gonna do here, I'm gonna go ahead and stick these off to the side to dry. You do not have to refrigerate these, just stick them on the counter off to the side while you cook whatever meals you're gonna cook. And they'll harden for about like 15 to 30 minutes, depending on how cool it is in your house. And once these get nice and hardened, I'll pop back on and show you the end result. All right, so as you can see, these are nice and stuck together at this point, and that's exactly what we want. So when you're placing those together, make sure that you get them on quickly so that they give that nice shape to it. Again, they don't have to be perfect. As you can see, this one's a little bit of a messy haystack, but now that we've got that, we're gonna give it a nice little taste. Mmm. These are so good for any barbecue or fall get together. That butterscotch is so good, guys. I hope you get to try it this season. Enjoy.